<laughs> what up, future? Gosh, I can't believe you guys actually got me to 30 likes and um, without me actually having to like my own video this time. And you guys are crazy. You guys really want to see me a little bit more of me and what I do, huh? I can't thank you guys enough. So uh, I'm actually going to tag you guys along to work tonight. Only reason is because I am unable to get out to LA. It's awesome. Uh, I'll definitely release a video this upcoming Saturday as well. And I'll tag you guys along for the journey this upcoming week. And I'm sleepy. It's 11 o'clock in the morning. Went to the gym just earlier. So again, let's head to the hospital when I wake up. Yo, all right, so I spared y'all all the boring stuff where I like to get ready and all that. I'm all ready, it's already about 5.50 and uh, the bus routine that I usually go to, I don't know if y'all saw that one video with what I did. I'm gonna go through another, through another way because the new bus stops are open, so uh, it took me a couple days to kind of figure it out. I was using Uber, but now let's head out here shortly. So as of recent, my protein came out with this new product called My Amino Boost. I've been using this to wake myself up every morning. The difference between this and My Amino Complex is this comes with, uh, with uh, caffeine. And instead of drinking coffee, I feel like the benefits are better for this. Especially if you're a builder. Because co coffee, some people like to drink their coffee with a lot of sugar and this right here has different amino compounds and they've added like different um, stuff to it to make it sweet BPI. I drink that when um, I don't need caffeine in my BCAs. Look at all my protein stuff guys. I've also been studying for, uh, I've been keeping it low key, but uh, in, my in my profession and, and my specialty, I've been studying for what's called a CCRN exam, and hopefully I pass. This, this exam is very hard. <laughs> well, I have a friend right now coming to pick me up. His name is Nelson. That'll save me actually a great deal of time instead of having to walk all the way around the new station it takes me about 15 minutes just to walk and get there so yeah i'll see you at work and of course again with limitation and i'll talk to you whenever i can during my breaks kind of keep you up to date with how my night's going and it's crazy because you guys really love to see this stuff and i'm seeing a little bit more interaction this time around so i'll see you during my next break All right guys, so I had a question for all the ones who are tuning in and watching these videos. What do you guys think about the editing? Um, you could either tell me by a comment or leave a thumbs up if you, if you like it and enjoy it a lot more. It really does help me out. Man, can never get used to this. So as of the moment, I am pulling up drugs that I need for my patient, particularly morphine. So after surgery, usually you're in a lot of pain. We just pulled what's called a, a tube out of their mouth, <laughs> endotracheal tube. There you go. It's about 9.38 in the evening, time for some lunch. I got chicken cordon bleu, veggies, and rice. In recap, so far what's happened tonight was I was able to get my patient off of her um, ventilator. I gave some albumin. That is a volume expander. It helps uh, bring up your blood pressure. It's also a, a protein. The main goal for this evening is pain control and blood pressure control. The patient is currently on what's called epinephrine. It is a natural catecholamine that happens in the body. She's also on insulin. And insulin, um, if you didn't know, stops producing when epinephrine is given. So we have to give her insulin so we can keep her blood blood sugars under control. Heading back up to the fifth floor and getting back to work. See you guys during my break. Uh, this is the least discreet way I can vlog. <laughs> Got some goldfish. And um, before I eat this goldfish, I just want to say how thankful I am to be alive and healthy. But I'm eating something bad. 
I experience a lot of codes. For those who don't know what that means, um, I deal with what's called code blue or a pulmonary, cardiopulmonary arrest. And um, I deal with that a lot. And it can be very stressful to see something like that on a, on not a daily basis, but a weekly basis. And any day above six feet above the ground is a great day. So be thankful that you guys are live and kicking. Anyways, that's, that about wraps up this uh, break. I have like 20 minutes. Time to watch some Casey Neistat. Alright, so every morning we give what are called CHG baths. This prevents the patient from actually getting an infection, especially if they are fresh out of the OR. So it is now my second or my third break, and what it boils down to is what am I gonna snack on? Cheez-Its. Go in. And that was my shift, guys. <laughs> oh, man. Hard as hell. Anyways, uh, thank you guys for getting that last video to 30 likes. And um, let's make it, let's, let's, let's up the ante, all right? So if this video gets 40 likes, all right? 40 likes, I'll do a, a video next Wednesday. But this, this Saturday is a given. I will release another video, maybe a vlog this upcoming Saturday. But uh, next Wednesday will be determined by this video. Will be determined by this video. So, yeah. Anyways, I am going to edit this video, do a little bit of reviewing, and go to sleep. I'll see y'all in the next video I produce. I'll take care. Hey guys, thank you for watching up till this point. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment. I like to talk to you guys. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. It shows me that I have your support. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Again, thank you very much. You guys take care. Peace. Check out my other videos that I have to offer.